in after day. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm Abbott. Hey, before we watch the video, I want you to go check out a, a new YouTuber. His name is Intros for You. Intros for You. See you right there. Um, he's a new YouTuber. He's actually not new, but he, this account is new. He makes intros 100% free. He made my intro. Um, he's a really good job. So 100% free. Just go check him out. Link in the sidebar. Go subscribe. Now watch my video. Hey guys, I'm Abbott here, and this is uh, not an app review. This is a little how-to tutorial video for actually a couple things. The first one is how to get some city apps for free, not like, recently some city apps you have to pay for. And uh, I'm going to show you a source you can add to get them, most some of them for free. And then next is going to be, after this, after I show you that, I'm going to show you how to access your iPod or iPhone through the computer with that, like, very simple, extremely simple, um, just one program you need to download. And then I'm going to show you how to add um ROMs to a GPS phone which is right there. So uh what you wanna do is open up Cydia. You need to have a jailbroken iPod touch. That's probably why you're watching this. You're probably gonna have a you're probably gonna have a jailbroken iPod if you're watching this. So um yes let's let Cydia load very long. Sorry am I calling the camera weird it's just that I didn't want to set it down and have to move everything, so, uh, yeah. Go to Manage, right there. Then go to Sources. Then you're going to add a source at the top right. You see Edit, click Edit. Edit. And then, Add, right there. Well, let's let City just reload its data. Can you hit Add? No. Nah. Wait till it reloads the data, that always happens. Okay. So, once again, you're going to want to hit edit right there. Top right. And then go to the left, hit add. And the repo you're going to add is... Uh, whoops. Repo. Dot. Sinful iPhone iPhone dot com. That will be in the video description. Repo at sinful iPhone dot com. Thing wanna hit add source, but I already added the source, so I'm not gonna do it. You hit add source and it just it would say reloading sources, go to the little um black screen, so and then hit done, top right, hit done. Then go to that source. And now you can see that some of the things in here are free already, but some of them are not free. Like a GPS phone, that's the new one. That one's normally, I think, $5. And they also have uh, iType Faster. That's paid now. And Nest 3. And, yes, yeah, so you want to go to GPS phone, which is under G. And then you get this. Go to the top right. For you, it will say install, but for me, it's modified because I already have it installed. So what you had to do is press that. It would bring you to the uh, next screen, and then you have to confirm it. For me, it just says reinstall, remove. So cancel. Now go back home, and now GPS phone should be installed. It might not look like that. I have a theme that makes it look like this. So open it, and as you see, I already have a ROM already, Pokemon Emerald. So now what you do. Connect it to the computer, and I'm gonna want to download a free program. It's called iPhone Browser. Um, you can just go to Google and search iPhone Browser. It'll come as the um up as the first link, or I'm just gonna put the link in the description. And what you do is just download the first one. There's my mouse right there. That exe, that one, the first one. And uh, yeah. So once you download that, let me just close iTunes. Uh, there we go. And yeah, so go to now go open it once it's installed. So I installed iPhone wrong. Open up iPhone browser. 
And now it will just load, it would say refreshing folders and stuff. So once it's loaded, and I just minimize that. I go to Google and just search, uh, really what kind of ROMs you're looking for. So I'm just going to search GBA ROMs. Now let's just go to the first one, which is doperoms.com. I don't know if you can really see that. Doperoms.com. You can go to any one, but this is this one I've been using for a while. It's a very good one. So now you can just go up to the search and just type in something. What is there a good? I'll just search Pokemon. Download a different version. Pokemon. Enter. So now you just scroll down and look for one. Um, let's download Pokemon Ruby. Just click on it. Bring it to another screen. Scroll down. Hit download ROM. Scroll down. Hit download right there. Now it should be downloading. 15 seconds around. Okay, now once that's downloaded, now you just have to open it. So you can use 7 zip, WinRAR, anything that opens a dart RAR frog. Oh, actually, this is a .zip, excuse me. So you can just open it in Windows with uh, that. So, yeah. So as you see, it says Pokemon Ruby. What you want to do now is ex uh, not extract. Actually, just move that over to the side a little bit. Now, open up iPhone browser. Now, this is... Uh, okay, now this is very important. Watch closely. What you want to do is go down to uh, library. And then, uh, wait, no, not library. Wait. Sorry, guys, this is. I haven't really done this in a while. Uh, var, right here, var, mobile, media, ROMs, and then click on GBA. And now right here, it would say, this is the ones I already have installed. The GBA BIOS, that's installed by default when you install the um, GPS phone. And then you see I have Pokemon Emerald already. So what you want to do is just go back to whatever program you have the, it opened in. Take it, drag it into here. Let go. Then down here, you'll see the little progress bar. And now it's done. So right there. So now close it. Close everything really. And now if you go here, hit the home button. Open up GPS phone again. It should be there. Yep, Pokemon Ruby. Let's just open it just to show you guys it works. Um, landscape and sound. And there you go, it's Pokemon, Ruby version. And there you go. And this iPhone browser, this is a really good program. I just, I want to just show you guys it again. 100% free, and it's very, very good. You can add music this way as well without going to going to iTunes. I don't know the way. I think it's library. It's under somewhere here. Uh, but oh, he, they also have themes. Here's your themes folder. But yep, remember guys, if you have any comments, questions, or requests, you can send an email to an app at live dot com. Follow me on Twitter right here, twitter dot com slash daily app reviews. Go to my website and update at wordpress dot com. Follow me on daily booth and daily dot com slash um an app a day. So, yep, that's how you would uh, get some video paid apps for free. My dog right there. And uh, what else did I teach you guys? iPhone browser, very simple. That will be in the description. The link to get that. And also, how to get the ROMs. That will also be in the description. DopeRoms.com See you guys.